Syringomyelia, an artist journey. The normal person can wake up thinking about what they have to do today. Work, chores, preparation for the next week. We do without wondering if we are able to do it. For someone with a disease, there is a lot more that needs to be considered. And sometimes there are times when you may not be able to do things or anything at all. This is the story of a man who came to the United States to make a better life. His syringomyelia diagnosis changed it forever. Syringomyelia is identified by the presence of cysts inside the spinal cord. Syringomyelia can damage the spinal cord and nerves, leading to complex complications. Through the struggles and heartache, he pushed through to fight for himself. This is Adam's journey. Born in Poland, Adam immigrated to the United States in 1998. With limited education, he was only able to find construction or distribution jobs. He worked up until his diagnosis. The day he was diagnosed, he was completely confused by what the doctor was saying. He had not heard of syringomyelia, and even the doctor that explained his diagnosis spelled it incorrectly. So he turned to Google. He read about the symptoms and realized that he was going through all of it. But the more he researched, the more scared he became. It was a struggle to find doctors that could understand where he was coming from. This was further complicated by the growing number of healthcare professionals and institutions needed for his care. While they diagnosed him at one hospital, he was referred to another for surgery and a third for specialized treatments. He found that it is much harder when you do not have concrete proof to talk to doctors, and it brings a lot of fear and uncertainty. Fear substantiated when questions brought on by his own research and resources were met with anger for being challenged. He has experienced anxiety visiting doctors since because few understand his rare diagnosis. He never painted before his disability. Four months ago, when Adam could not sleep because of his pain, he began to watch YouTube videos about painting and became inspired. The next day, he bought supplies and made his first attempt, birch trees reminding him of home back in Poland. Sometimes what keeps you going are the people around you. Adam's partner has been his greatest support and source of happiness. Never once has he felt like a burden for not being able to work. With all his family in Poland, it is hard to be away. A week into his diagnosis, he connected with Beth, a registered nurse and the executive director of Worldwide Syringomyelia and Chiari Task Force. She helped him better understand his diagnosis and how to advocate for himself through the ever-evolving healthcare system he now had to navigate. At the same time, he continued to paint in a small corner of his house. He found that painting gave him satisfaction. He was able to do something besides laying on the couch all day. Instead of losing himself in fear and giving up, he had something that brought him joy and accomplishment. The landscapes, animals, and flowers transport him outside of his house to a place of beauty and peace, a place where everyone is different but share a commonality, where we are all together surviving and thriving. Now he wants others to view his art and take joy from it like he does. The people from the Worldwide Syringomyelia and Chiari Task Force SM support groups pick him up when he is down. Sometimes they just let him be down while making sure he knows they are there for him no matter what. He wants others to know that there will always be someone there for you, no matter how hard it gets. Worldwide Syringomyelia and Chiari Task Force has been there too. He is a part of a strong family who cares about his journey. Adam has agreed to help raise funds for the SM community by donating half of all sales of the beautiful paintings shown in this video to support the mission of WSCTF. The 501c3 nonprofit mission focuses on targeted education to increase understanding about SM and Chiari across all medical disciplines starting with primary care. To learn more about a painting and to make a donation, contact us today.
This painting is titled Mighty Mountain. Education empowers and makes a way for future generations. Visit our website at www.wstfcure.org or you can email us at wstfcure at wstfcure.org or you can call us at 914-510-2873. We look forward to hearing from you.